Hey guys, angry guy here, and I have your crypto daily news here for you. It's going to be a little short today, but we have a lot to talk about. Facebook is launching their own coin. It's going to be called Global Coin, and think crazy things are happening with Dogecoin. So we're just going to jump into it first with our first topic of the day. And this is going to be about the Coinbase debit card. Many people were dismayed when Coinbase ended their partnership partnership with ShiftPay uh, earlier this year. And ShiftPay basically allowed people to use a debit card to withdraw funds directly from their Coinbase account. Since that has happened, since they ended their partnership, Coinbase has launched a debit card in the UK and now they are actually teasing, they've confirmed that it will actually be coming to the United States. They have not provided a clear date, but it does appear to be quite soon. The CEO was recently sitting down at a conference, uh, Coinbase CEO Brian Armstrong, and he announced that the company is working on introducing its debit card to customers in the United States. So I think a lot of people are going to be really happy with that, especially since right now, in the US, your only other choice for a debit card to withdraw crypto is BitPay. And it's not really an option for everyone or not an optimal option for everyone. So it's great to have competition. There's also some other cards coming, but this is definitely going to be the, the next big competitor. So let's go ahead and watch out for that. Okay, and other news, Dogecoin, of course, the, coin, the little coin that could continues to heat up the market and dogecoin is now being called by many a better you heard me better choice than bitcoin so for those of you that don't know the history of dogecoin i'll just fill you in this crypto joke is a better invested investment than bitcoin seriously as is what some people are saying originally created as a programmer's practical joke dogecoin has divided the odds to cement its place near the top of the crypto market. Joke or not, however, this cryptocurrency is about to mount a serious challenge to Bitcoin and prescient investors could yield a 185% windfall. windfall. Now, Dogecoin flashes wildly bullish signals. Through the years, one cryptocurrency trading formula that has stood the test of time is buying support while the market is oversold. The more oversold, the better. That's because oversold conditions provide selling relief. In other words, supply tends to dry up because the price is so low that no one ten, no one's interested in selling. Meanwhile, buyers return because the market is cheap. You don't have to be a rocket science to, scientist to put two and two together, right? Rising demand plus low supply very often equates to a price surge. And we're seeing this dynamic happen with Dogecoin, which is seeing prices at 0.00294 or 38 Satoshis. So right now, this is a quite significant and we are potentially looking at Dogecoin surging to as much as like two cents in the coming weeks, if not less, and maybe even more by the end of the year. So this is definitely a coin to watch. It may actually end up having even better returns than Bitcoin. So definitely, if you don't have any Dodge, go and pick some up. And in our final news today, what probably you've been waiting to hear about, Facebook is launching their own coin and it will evidently be known as Global Coin. It's set to come out in 2020. And basically, while details are scarce, this is what we have so far. The news and broadcasting organization said on Friday that uh, the BBC, this was reported on the BBC, uh, they said on Friday that Facebook is planning to launch the cryptocurrency-based payment system in a dozen countries by the first quarter of 2020 and is looking to start trials by the end of this year. And Facebook has apparently sought advice from officials of the U.S. Treasury and the Bank of England, Governor Mark Carney, 
regarding opportunities and regulatory issues for the initiative, which is internally referred to as Project Libra. And more details about Facebook's crypto plan are expected to be revealed in coming months, the report said. The news comes amid recent reports that Facebook has been in talks with payment firms including Western Union, Visa, and MasterCard to back and fund its planned fiat-based cryptocurrency. So, Facebook is definitely making some moves. On May 2nd, Facebook registered a new entity called Libra Networks in Geneva, which will provide financial and technology services and developed related hardware and software. And last month, it was reported that Facebook could be seeking as much as $1 billion to fund the crypto stablecoin project. So, I mean, me personally, I think a lot of people are going to not going to want to use Facebook. The new global coin. I mean, it sounds. It literally sounds like well, like one world order coin, like the one coin to rule them all, and it's probably going to be extremely shady. I don't. I doubt that it's going to be open source. Maybe it will be. Even then, I mean, can you imagine like Facebook having access to like you know your funds? Like imagine like your Facebook accounts get shut down or deleted or are suspended, and your funds are on your Facebook account. So let's say you have a couple thousand dollars on there and doom, just like that, Facebook can seize your funds. They can shut you out. I mean, that that doesn't sound good at all. I mean, that completely defeats the purpose of cryptocurrency. And I'm sure Mark will, will try to find some way to make it sound good. And, you know, there's obviously going to be a lot of people that will probably still end up using it just because of the convenience. And it's funny because like then, you know, initially I'll start off like, oh, this is great. And then everyone's like, oh my gosh, this is awful. Facebook can like just take your funds. And it's like, yeah, yeah. But anyway, let me know what you guys think about this. If you are, if you're into the idea of a Facebook coin, if it's something you would use, you already know my take. I would, I don't want to go anywhere near Facebook. I don't even have an account. Let me know if you're excited for the new Coinbase card coming to US customers. And also, if you think that Dogecoin really will surpass Bitcoin or if it has the potential to. I definitely think it, it has a lot of potential. And I think Dodge is something that everyone should keep some of in their wallets. So let me know what you think. We'll talk about it in the comments. I hope you enjoyed this uh, shorter version of Crypto News Daily. Love God, get money, and cheers.